This video will demonstrate how to uh, download products while you're working inside of a project editor. So uh, here I have one open and uh, if there's a product that you want to add that's not currently in your catalog, you can click the uh, download button uh, directly here in the project editor to open up the uh, DTools data browser. And then from here, you can search for what you're looking for. Now this is going to download to your catalog. Um, so uh, from there though you can add it directly to your project either go back to the project file and hit the add button or uh, a method I'll show you in just one second once I download something let's go ahead and grab um, this amplifier right here let's go ahead and download it and you can see that it was downloaded over here if you right click you can choose add to project and it will show uh, open projects in this case this is the project file I'll go ahead and hit uh, add and now when you close this, uh, back here in the project editor, you'll see that this has been assigned down here. It uh, has not been given a location yet. It, it'll come into the product as unassigned, um, so there's no location or system assigned to it. Um, a nice quick way to do that is, is via the drop zone here. You can just uh, select um, your system, select where it's going, and then drag it up to assign it. And now that's been assigned that location, uh, you'll have to hit refresh in order to see that. But now if you go to the equipment room, you can expand this and uh, you can sort, uh, let's see, manufacturer. And there's the part that was uh, reassigned to that location and system.